Well, Steph Curry, I mean, it's on your screen right now. Seems like he's done it all, right? Two-time MVP, most threes in NBA history, uh, three championships chasing a fourth, six finals appearances. But here's the thing, zero finals MVP. Zeke, and whenever you have the basketball talk about Steph Curry, where he is historically, you were a finals MVP. Do you think... Steph Curry in these finals is going to gun to win it this year and get that monkey off his back. I, I, I think he will, and, and I honestly hope he does. I mean, mm. there, there aren't many times when you have a chance to achieve greatness or play for greatness, right? And, you know, I admire, like, LeBron James right now chasing Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, chasing that, 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 that label of being the greatest ever. Because there's only three or four people who ever got to chase that. I admire Steph Curry for, for chasing, and I hope he does, this finals MVP. Because, you know, how many times do you get a chance to really play for that great, great opportunity and that greatness? So, you know, you, you should go for it. And I know he'll sit back and say, well, you know, it's just about the team and it's about winning. Yeah, it's about the team and it's about winning. But very few and rare times in sports, in a team sport in particular, where it does become about you too. So, you know, his place in history with this finals MVP is etched and, and, and moved up, uh, you know, another level, which is great for him and it's great for the game. Because the more you can, the more you can, you know, up the game, the better it is for the next generation that's coming. Describe how difficult it is to win an MVP as opposed to a finals MVP when you look at anything that you accomplish in your career. You, the finals MVP, I'm, I'm, I'm excuse me, I, I am the baddest. <laughs> ain't, 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 ain't no. So you put finals MVP as like higher than well, regular season MVP? In that particular point in time, right? Because not only are you saying, my team is the best team mm -hmm. in the world, but now I've been acknowledged as the best player during this particular time in this season and, and also in this playoffs. There's, there's nobody better than, than you at this particular time when you're the finals MVP and then your team also wins the championship. You are crowned and acknowledged as the best team and also the best player in the finals. That's pretty special. Yeah, I mean, Steph Curry's still the only player to be named MVP unanimously, right? Still has that under his belt. But you always hear it. Oh, about the finals MVP. This is an opportunity for him to go grab it. Yeah, this is an opportunity to him, again, for him to go grab it. And I believe his teammates want that for him. And, and I hope that he goes out and try to accomplish that. In the, in, in the confines of trying to win the basketball game and trying to win the series. So I really does hope that happens for him.